Hydrogen House Project presents the Jewelbox Portable Hydrogen Charge Station, a compact mobile power plant integrating several renewable energy technologies to store and generate electricity for homes and businesses, as well as provide electric and hydrogen vehicle refueling capabilities. The Jewelbox harnesses solar and wind energy and stores it in the form of hydrogen gas by way of electrolysis, splitting water molecules and storing the hydrogen as backup power for times when the sun isn't shining and the wind isn't blowing. Now, to go into some of the features, why this is the most energy dense renewable piece of equipment on the planet, we start with the solar panels. So we have two kilowatts of solar mounted on here and a one kilowatt wind turbine. So the unit will operate day or night if you have the wind resource. In addition to that, these weigh three pounds per panel, not 50. Two people can take this off in a matter of minutes with four bolts. So you have to transport this thing. You unbolt the four bolts, you pull the array off, you throw it on a trailer and you take it with you. The other unique thing about the jewel box is the footprint. This puts it on a pallet. You can drop a dozen of these on a trailer and you can take it anywhere you want. If you have a hurricane coming, it's minutes to take it down if you've got bad weather or you need to transport and move it in a hurry. This is able to uh, gain 33% more sunlight because we use GPS to do the tracking. Because we use GPS, it knows where it is in the world. It knows what season of the year it is. It knows what time of day is. And without seeing the sun, it's always perfectly aligned with the sun to gain the maximum amount of power. So all of these technologies are very unique to make this the most energy dense piece of equipment on the planet. The jewel box's components are housed in a lockable rugged steel container ideal for tough weather conditions. Inside you'll find a small battery bank coupled with ultra capacitors, an off-grid inverter, charge controllers, and a hydrogen fuel cell. Mounted on top is a 2 kilowatt tracking solar array and a 1 kilowatt wind turbine. The back of the jewel box contains the hydrogen electrolyzer and storage tanks. Operating the jewel box is easy. Very simple. You plug in your cord in the, in the jewel box and you plug it into the vehicle. The light comes on two hours later, it's full. The jewel boxes are adaptable to any size home. Some people live in a 10,000 square foot home. Some people live in a 300 square foot home. This unit is capable of doing up to 100 kilowatts by just adding more inverters and just plugging in more plug and play solar. The jewel box's power generation and storage capabilities are scalable to meet the energy needs of the consumer by simply adding more solar panels, batteries, and hydrogen storage tanks. This is expandable to as many tanks as you want. So once all the tanks are full, you need more storage, break out another propane tank made into billions all over the world. For added energy storage, the jewel box can be upgraded to high pressure. This particular fuel module that you see behind me is a standard piece of equipment that has CE ratings. So this can already be placed anywhere under local codes. The jewel box can even be outfitted with a water purification system for the ultimate off-grid solution. By the time you go through the federal rebates for fuel cells, the 30% ITC credit, and state and local credits, the jewel box can be as little as 40% of the original starting cost. And you'll, you'll qualify for advanced depreciation as well, so you can write the whole thing off uh, in a very short period of time. Uh, so as far as cost effective, right now with the federal subsidies till 2016, this is a no-brainer. This will backfeed the grid. A regular generator sits there and does nothing and costs you money. This particular one will make you money. 